Tempesta Fancy is voiced by Tsubame Yuzuki, right there. And it's an extremely famous uh, R18 SMR voice actress, just like Golden Hind. So they're being voiced by um, um, SW actresses, apparently. Subscribe, please. Hi, guys. We have a lot. The past few days, essentially, for the past two days, I believe, we've been finally officially getting the announcement for the upcoming uh, Tempesta characters. And we have confirmation it is going to be brand new ship girls. This is not a simple rerun. These are simply brand new character and this is absolutely awesome so we are gonna get some sailing frigates so first and foremost we have the beautiful fancy i'm glad you don't seem to fear me even though i'm known as being of the abyss i'll be watching you to see what sort of human you are fancy is preparing to sort it. she will grace your dark in the near future blah 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 so here we can see her design and she is looking just amazing absolutely amazing um, yeah, that is, that is crazy. So anyway, um, she's from Tempesta. Obviously, she's going to be a super rare character. And if we see here, um, she is looking pretty good, mostly on shelling HP. So she's probably quite tanky here. Uh, we have a bit of evasion and the rest is pretty low. So anyway, looking at her design, she obviously looks amazing. She has everything a Tempesta like. She has a bunch of like, like those spikes here, like going through her, her feet and hands. Very, very... I wonder if they actually go through or if it's like, you know, it's like this one part of the top, one part of the bottom. But I mean... Seeing her, it might as well go through. It's quite possible. I don't know. Uh, but obviously, we have the, the famous tentacles. There's not a lot of... Uh, I think there's only one character that doesn't have tentacles in the... In the Tempesta lineup. And I think that's the one with the angel wings. Um, so here, we have massive tentacles. We see the cannons. We see the mast of the pirate ship. And she is looking great. We can see like some of the emotions here. Some of the, the expression down here are kind of crazy let me let me go there so you can see it like look at that look at that smile i'm trying super hard to do this but i'm being a massive dweeb at it see here that toothless smile is crazy she look insane <laughs> so yeah anyway she's looking really really good very excited for her she looks amazing and uh, apparently i just saw that in the comments um but apparently um, Tempesta Fancy is voiced by Tsubame Yuzuki, right there. And it's an extremely famous uh, R18 SMR voice actress, just like Golden Hind. So they're being voiced by um, um, SW actresses, apparently. So that's interesting. Uh, moving on from Fancy, we also have Portsmouth Adventure, which, crazily enough, crazily enough, is the thickest character we've ever had, I'm pretty sure. Uh, Portsmouth Adventure, you that commander you have heard tons about, my eyes are set on claiming not just you, but all the treasures in the world wide world. Portsmouth Adventure is preparing to sort you. And look at her. Like, I, I, I don't have the words. She's insane. So um, she's a sailing frigate here. Uh, we can see that she's uh, BCC, blah, 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 whatever. I, who cares about that? Um, but she is incredibly freaking thick, dude. Look at her. That is crazy. She she seems to be so such a bon vivant kind of girl. Like, she's super happy. She's, like, drinking wine. Uh, she has, like, a bunch of treasure. The cannons on her ship with, like, the, the, the ghouls looking here are so cool. She has, like, some, like, undead vultures flying around. Obviously, we have some tentacles. There's this, like, dark goop being around. It looks like maybe, like, Iker or something, like, demonish blood. 
Um, it's kind of interesting because I've got Nikkei in the mind right now because I just finally finished the entire like story available. She reminds me of uh, Behemoth as also like this black um, liquid-ish armor that like kind of is alive and protects her. That looks exactly like this, essentially. But yeah, she seems to be an incredibly greedy person, so much so that she, she kept all of it in her booba and thighs, and she is looking incredible. She is looking incredible. Uh, also, pretty cool detail here. She she has like golden, she has golden like nail polish uh, on both her hands and feet as well. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Uh, so yeah, like her tricorn looks fantastic as well, uh, with like a, a golden um, like Cthulhu skull here. It, it's pretty insane. It's pretty insane. Uh, a design is... I don't know. I really like it. I really like it. Now, moving on, we have Dolphin. I'm Dolphin, and I'm a pirate, but it might be more accurate to say I'm a treasure hunter. Anyway, if you can call it a treasure, I can locate it. Look at her. She looks so cute, dude. I will say it. She looks absolutely adorable. She's so cute. She's simply so freaking cute, and I love her. She's my daughter. I will protect her. Nobody touches her. She's mine. Don't touch my daughter! She's the cutest! Uh, she looks amazing. I really like the, the small golden thing. She has like some keys on those little tentacles here. Uh, interesting enough, this is like... Uh, the big tentacles is like Kraken, but those are more squid. Like, they're flatter. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, I really like the gold thing here that ends in a big circle. Big, 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 big... Um, I don't know what to call it. And she also has like some, some anklets as well. Uh, she's looking really cool! Too bad, like, every time there's a small character that looks adorable, it's always a elite. That's not true, we did get a Jui Ho that was a SR, I guess. Um, but yeah, just looking overall absolutely amazing. Uh, very happy about that. And uh, I, I definitely want to get at least one copy. I think she looks great. Uh, I love that she's like a, a, a just a treasure hunter. Like, we have, like, massive coffers behind her. And uh, she... I like it. I like it. I like that the tentacles also have, like, the tip or, like, tipped in gold. Um, I think she looks great. I think she simply looks great. Um, she's very adorable. And uh, I like the dolphin. I like dolphin as a name. I think it's cute. Makes me happy. Reminds me of uh, the, Wii, the Wii console. Now, moving on, we have another and, I think, final super rare character. Commander, I'm Amity. He's hoping we'll get along. So let's cut to the chase and get to know each other, shall we? And look at her. Damn, she looks amazing. Uh, Selling forget, blah, 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 blah. Uh, she is a super rare unit. And I, 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 I love this. I absolutely love this. The red here is so cool. Uh, it's nice to see, because generally speaking, the Tempesta seems to have a lot of blues, um, specifically. And here we see, like, massive cannons. Uh, I love her outfit. She has a beautiful dress. I love the, the like the dress seems alive by itself. Inside of it, you can see this like um, stuff that looks like tentacles. So it, it's on theme, on brand, right? Um, she has one horn, it seems. I love the fire around the eyes. It's very um, chuny, bougie. I don't remember how it's called. It's like the illusion of grandeur, the, the second grade syndrome, or whatever it's called. Uh, I love that she also has, like, a crown inside of that um, tentacle dress here. Um, she looks absolutely amazing. I adore her design. And uh, here in the back, you see an eye. This is how a pupil of um, octopus or squid looks like, actually. It's super, super weird. But uh, this is the one. She looks... I think she's my favorite. I actually think she's my favorite. She's so cool looking. I cannot wait to get her. Um... <laughs> And uh, yeah, I'm just loving, 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 loving your design. Now, if I were to say what's my favorite design... Oh, I missed one. I I'm so sorry. I missed one. I missed Ganji Isawai. Well, Matt, I'm Ganji Isawai. I'll be talking here for the foreseeable future in the name of the wind. Blessing be upon you and your port. So she's also a super rare unit. And here, man, she's looking great. Um, with the long dress... Um, like being super tight here at the waist kind of gives the mermaid a lure to her. She's holding a katana. She seems to be having a a, a halo as well. 
Uh, you can see like those cannons here. I'm not sure if those are cannons or it was just like bottles of champagne, but they're made of like gold scales. It's really, really cool looking. Uh, it's interesting to see it like I, she's obviously this is meant to resemble a mermaid here, but then it ends in a multitude of like different um, tentacle. Right, it's like this is meant to resemble tentacles at the end here, I think. Uh, she's looking great. She's looking absolutely fantastic. I love that she has like a lantern here attached to her. Um, it's it's pretty cool. I wonder if is this anglerfish? <laughs> I don't know, but I love it. The boat over there is really cool looking too. There's a big treasure chest there. Uh, I really like her. So now that we are done with all of the design, I think if I had to pick my favorite, I think my favorite is definitely going to be Amity, 100%. She's just so cool looking. Then I think it's a tough call between Fancy and Ganji. I think I'm going to say I prefer Fancy. Ugh. Okay, I prefer Fancy's name, but I think I prefer Ganji Sawai's design. She's so beautiful. I love the hair with the colors. It's just so pretty. So I think I would say Amity is my favorite. Top two is going to be Ganji. Uh, then it's gonna be fancy, and that's for the ESR, right? If I had to pick, like, my actual favorite after Ganji, it would be Dolphin. I think Dolphin, I actually prefer her design more than fancy, because I think she's just so adorable, and sometimes adorable is better than sexy. It is what it is. Now, moving on, Portsmouth. Uh, I think I like her. I think it's nice to have a very different kind of uh, character and body type. It's pretty nice. Uh, I do really like her. Um... But uh, yeah, unfortunately, with the quality of the other sheep girls we have, um, she she simply cannot compare to the other girls here. Now, we do have some skin being announced, obviously, and this is all Halloween themed. So first and foremost, we have one for Fancy, which is the first character. And interestingly enough here, we get to see her. Um, we get to actually see her without the, the eye mask, right? So we can see her eyes and they are silver. Uh, oh, you found me. This is horror fashion, and I've heard it's pretty popular. Boo. Scared. Fancy is changing to a new attire. So what is absolutely crazy here, and might explain why she had a toothless green, is that if you zoom in... I'm sorry for the nightmare-inducing thing about to happen, or not, you know, to each their own. We can see the expression here. And here, I know the quality is not the highest, and it's very pixelated, but she, she actually does seem to not have any teeth. And here, she has a triple tongue! Ah, the nightmare! Not the triple tongue! And she also has a pacifier. You know what? Keep the pacifier on. Don't show me that tongue. I don't want to know what those tongues do. I'm sure a lot of guys are like, oh, potential. But I, I think that's creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on! You heard my song, thank goodness someone's finally come for me. Say, could you please remove the seal on me? Yeah, so she's like, mermaid in distress, there it is. But this time, with this skin, she's actually a proper mermaid. It's not a dress, it, it ends up fully into those um, fins or whatever it's called. And she's looking great here. Um, she seems to be singing. Uh, and uh, yeah, she's she's just a singing mermaid at the bottom of the awesome of the of the of the awesome of the ocean. Uh, here we can see some of her expression. Uh, it's just her singing uh, and looking at us every now and then, uh, looking great, looking great. We we do like mermaids. I do like mermaids, personally speaking. I think they're cool. Uh, and now I think we still have a few skins that have been shown. Uh, yeah, uh, all of the characters are getting a skin, so that's pretty cool. Wait, Commander. You're here way ahead of time. No, this is not what my special surprise is supposed to be. Uh, we have... Jesus Christ. An adventure surprise uh, from Portsmouth Adventure. And she is... Uh, she has like those bat wings and big horns, which I really like the big horns. And she seems to be stuck in a... Uh... She is stuck in a... Um... You know, a web. So that's something for the, the thick enthusiast. Definitely, definitely. Uh, now we also have a skin. The incantation of revival. Sure, rising out of caffeine is a bit creepy, but still I'm going to hurt you. Promise. 
We have Dolphin. Uh, she's very cute. I think this skin is a bit much. As I said, I like my characters being cute, but when my characters are very small and very cute, I don't really want them to be sexualized. And this, to me, is a little bit much. Um, it is what it is. Preferences, all that, all that, you know, you know. Uh, but still, Dolphin is absolutely the cutest. Look at the beautiful smile. She's the, she's so cute. I, I love her. Now, moving on from her skin, we still have one more, and that is the Friendly Franken. I win again, so I'll be taking your treasure. Follow me down if you're brave enough to jump. I'm just changing to a new dynamic attire. And I actually really like it. I will say I absolutely adore the her base skin because of like all the fire etc but here her dress like she has that ghost dress is really cool the hat is awesome it's very it's very gothic it's very uh it's just cool right it's just cool and she's obviously a frankenstein here you can see like the this part of the leg is a different color um it's really really cool the things are cool are nice and she's grabbing one of the manju so this is always a good time to have so there she is and obviously this is a dynamic skin this means this is not an l2d but it will have some amount of animation right there right uh i'm sorry to say but this is obviously a twitter compression it's always terrible the quality is horrendous but you get to see kind of how it's going to be moving in game so there you go now moving on we have oh my god that just came out we literally had a new one Welcome guests to the dwelling of demons. That was six minutes ago before I started the video. I own this place. I will grant you any wish in exchange for a suitable price. Ijen Owari is changing to a new L2D attire. Oh my... Oh my god. How does she look at base? Oh, it's her! Holy crap! I didn't even recognize her! Oh, she looks divine! That is crazy! Oh my god, that might be my favorite. Definitely my favorite. Because it's also, like, very different, you know what I mean? Like, base Owari compared to Owari compared to this one is very different. Meanwhile, these ones, I mean, they feel kind of on brand with the fact that they're Tempesta, right? It's already pretty Halloween, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, damn. Also, we do have a ASMR here. This is a preview of an ASMR. Um, and I'm not going to play it. Uh, I assume... That, at least in Japanese, probably voiced by the R18 ASMR artist, right? That would make sense. Uh, so, yeah, anyway, this is... If you want to listen to it, do check it out on their official Twitter. And, uh, yeah, anyway, thank you for watching. Let me know what you think. I'm personally incredibly excited. It's going to be my first Tempesta event ever because I've, I'm only a recent player. So I'm super, super hype. Uh, let me know who you're most excited about, which skin you want to get down in the comment. Like, subscribe, all the good good, and I'll see you later. Bye!